Well, hello everyone and welcome to another Funza Academy video. Credit cards, as you know, are an important part of our lives. We use them both in the real world as well as on the internet. But did you know that there was a hidden mathematical pattern in your credit card? A pattern that helps determine whether the credit card number is valid or not. So in this video, I will introduce you to this mathematical pattern. But first, you will need a credit or debit card that has 16 digits. And yes, some pen and paper. Ready? Let's begin. We will use a sample credit card number for this video. So here it is. I will first select the odd numbers of my card and write them down. So we have... 5, 9, 4, 1, 5, 4, 8 and 4. And then I will write down the even numbers here, like so. 3, 3, 6, 3, 3, 7, 1 and 0. Now I will do two things with this left number out here. First, I will count how many of its digits are greater than 4. So our answer is 4. Let me write this down. Next, I will add the digits of this top number. So we have 5 plus 9 plus 4 plus 1 and so on. That gives us 40. I will then double this result and that gives me 80. Let me write this down. Now let us focus on this number here and add its digits. That gives us 26. Cool! Almost there. Now we will add these three numbers and then check the last digit of the result. In a valid credit card, this last digit of our answer should be 0. So let's test our results. We have 80 plus 26 plus 4, which is 110. And yes, the last digit is 0. This method is called the Loon Formula and is a method used by websites, for example, to validate credit card numbers. If you want to know more, do check out the video description for useful links. So thanks for watching, guys. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. And yes, do subscribe to our channel. Thanks a lot and bye for now.